Let's cover the goblet squat. The goblet squat is just a fancy way of saying we're gonna do a squat holding a weight at our chest and slightly off of our chest. So chest height, but a little bit off. If you were to hold that weight on your chest, you're gonna arch your back and putting a lot of pressure on your lower back, which obviously we wanna avoid. Because this is a squat, you're gonna get in your squat position that feels best for you. So typically that is shoulder width apart or slightly wider with your toes facing forward or slightly out. That has to do with your mobility and what feels best. Okay, from here, before I go into my squat, I'm gonna twist my foot into the ground. I'm not actually going to move my foot, but I am gonna twist it and that's gonna help activate those leg muscles. So now that we have those basics done, let's grab the weight and actually go into the goblet squat. So I'm gonna go ahead and pop it up with a straight back, holding it at chest height, but slightly off. I'm gonna bring in my core to activate and brace, keep my abs nice and tight. My head is gonna stay up and then keeping my torso up tall and letting my knees go over my toes, I'm gonna to knock out the goblet squat. Because I'm twisting my feet into the ground, this is gonna help me push my knees outward and keep them over the, that toe, the toes like I was talking about. Because one thing that I see a lot of people do is letting their knees cave in. We don't want that to happen. We want to activate, keep twist those feet, and push those knees out. The depth that you're going to go into your squat will be determined by the type of workout that you're doing. So you might be doing quarter squats, you might be doing full range of squats, you might be doing squats with a pause at the bottom, but with that basic knowledge of where to hold your goblet, you'll be able to knock them out. So we'll knock out just a couple of each of those. Quarter and full. With a pause, chest stays up nice and tall. Don't let your hips go backwards. And that is the goblet squat. If you have any questions on it, let me know. I am going to be doing a lot more exercises. So if there's one that you would like to see broken down, let me know down in the comments and I can get to it faster. But make sure to like and subscribe so that you'll know when new ones come out.